What's up, YouTube? It's Aaron. Um, I just wanted to make a video, let you guys know how my tea changes have been going. Um, the last time I made a video was after my first shot with Kayla's, you know, reactions and all that stuff, and um, and I have not made a video since. So I've been really wanting to keep uh, keep track of these videos and make sure I'm, you know, posting because at the end of the day, this is for me to look back on and see the changes and what I was most excited about and all that stuff. And I've been doing that, so that's something I'm gonna be uh, prioritizing here um, because it's really important to me. Um, and I know, you know, when I first came out as transgender, the YouTube community was the my number one resource for like what to expect and what I wanted and how they reacted to it, you know, the things that I was looking forward to, like top surgery and testosterone and things like that. So um, it's important to me that I kind of, uh, you know, give back in any way that I can and let you guys know how I'm feeling and then also for my own record. So um, major changes, uh, week five. So number one, obviously my voice, okay. Literally, it's like waking up with a sore throat all the time but it's like you're not sore it doesn't hurt you just feel like raspy like you have the same sound but there's really no difference in feeling that i've experienced um it just feels yeah just it's just deeper which is just amazing because with my job you know we record a lot we make youtube videos and things like that um for our for our different brands that we manage um and so instead of having to you know be super worried about lowering my voice and staying deep and making sure that i pass i don't have to do any of that because my voice is already naturally dropping and it's only been five weeks so imagine you know three months from now it's going to be even different sounding than it is right now so i'm really excited for the changes and things like that to go through so that's number one my voice number two acne my face look at this i mean it is literally like when i was in high school and it's just it's terrible i see voice drop obviously Ugh. um so my acne um, I need to be making sure, you know, I have to make sure I'm washing my face twice a day and keeping up with it and um, because it's, my acne was really bad in high school, so it literally feels like I'm just going through uh, puberty again because, I mean, that's really what, what I'm doing. Um, I'm transitioning, so um, I knew this was coming. I knew it was going to happen, so I was prepared for it. Um, it's really just sticking to routine and keeping my face uh, kept up as possible. Um, but you know, it's just part of the process. So we got my voice, you got my, my acne. Number three is my posture. Like literally, you can't really tell because I'm wearing a jacket right now, but um, my shoulders alone, like usually when I would meet someone new or like introduce myself, I wanted to be able to pass. So I'd always have to be shoving my shoulders up and pushing my shoulders blades, my shoulder blades up, which just makes just a slight difference, but in mentally it really helped me out. So I was always conscious of shoving my shoulders up and and lowering my voice and making sure that they can, you know, like, so make sure I pass and that they're not like, oh, is this, is this one of those, you know what I mean? So, because I've had some bad experiences with that, but, you know, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter what people think of me. Um, that's one thing that testosterone has really helped me out with is just like, I know that my chemical makeup is the exact same as any other guy, you know, like, Obviously, I was I was born with super low testosterone because females also produce testosterone, but it's not as much as the males do, um, cis males do. So it's it's just. It was just like a big mental thing for me that it's in my body, it's working, it's doing its job, um, and I'm able to see the differences. Obviously, see the differences, but I can see my um, my throat, you know, my my throat like thickening, my vocal cords thickening, so my voice drops and stuff. So it's just exciting. So my posture is my shoulders have broadened up. Um, uh, I've noticed that my bones actually like are very like. Um, I feel like I'm just getting, I'm definitely gaining weight. Like that's, that's a no brainer. I don't know if it's because my appetite has gone up, which it has, but um, I'd like to think that it's not just food. Uh, it just depends, but um, I'm gaining a lot of muscle. I have not been working out like I wanted to. I wanted to be working out like three days a week. Um, and that's also something I need to prioritize more. Um, but I haven't been, so it's something to work on. I'm constantly improving, everyone is. Um, but like my my watches, the watch that I'm wearing right now, just it's the one of the adjustable ones. But the watch that I usually uh, wear is a silver, and it has like the clasp that clicks in and snaps on your wrist, and it's like set with the length size and everything. It's super tight. So and there's no like there's no chunk on my wrist. I'm not gaining weight in my wrist. It's just it feels like my bones are just thickening. So that's that's uh, another notice that I was able to to notice. Another change that I was able to notice. Um, so yeah, just like when I read about like what was going to be going on in my body, like being angry more often, more frustrated, none of that stuff has been happening. I've just been super positive and um, excited and 
Uh, I've just been really thankful to be even, oh, really thankful. Yeah, see, that's, that's my voice. Um, <laughs> my favorite part, though, so you know, I'm not complaining at all. Um, what was I saying? See, my voice drops are distracting. But pretty much it's just it's just been a combination of things, and I'm just thankful that I get the transition. And, um, I'm just excited to be able to do this and be able to push myself and um, just kind of see me become the man that I've always wanted to be. I mean, obviously testosterone doesn't make you less of a man if you choose not to transition and things like that, but for me it was really important and for me it was something I was really looking forward to, so um, I'm just excited for everything that's been happening. I'm sorry that I haven't been keeping up these videos, but I will be doing that way more often. I need to prioritize it because it's something that I have been um, making sure that uh, I've been, I prioritize. So, um, yeah, I just want to do a quick update video, let you guys know what my voice sounds like. Ooh, girl, I'm so excited. Um, yeah, and I'll, I'll be able to do some next video. I'll make sure I'm not wearing a sweatshirt so you can see, like, my, the shoulder difference and everything like that. But it's big time. I'm pumped. I'm excited. Um, so, yeah, if you have any questions, go ahead and drop them in the comments below. If you want to subscribe, subscribe to my channel, there'll be a button up here. There'll be, you know, some other videos that you can check out for, like, before I even got my shot and my first shot. Um, and I'll be busting out some content to put on here more often. Uh, just wanted to let you guys know what's going on. Keep you guys updated. Um, thank you for watching this video. Um, like I said, anyone I can help, I'd love to help. Um, uh, just like, I just want to give back for all the help that YouTube gave me when I first came out as transgender. So... Um, right, subscribe, watch the videos, drop a comment, any questions, concerns, I'll answer them. I'm very open about that. A lot of people are very closed off to their transition and don't want, um, you know, everything get, being out there, but I'm 100%. Um, I think the more we can educate people, the better. So, just, um, yeah, always here. Um, stay positive, think positive, um, and you guys have a great Friday.